His owner said it was just a horrible accident, but an animal rescue group wanted charges filed. Tonight, the Laurel County Grand Jury has decided not to indict anyone for the dragging death of a dog. Investigators say the dog was tied to the back of a truck when it was dragged down a road. Phil Pendleton has reaction to the grand jury's decision. It is called a no true bill, basically meaning no indictment and no criminal charges will be brought against the owners of Rocky the Boxer. The owners tell me this was just a big accident, but others claim that justice was not done. The owners of Rocky say what happened on the morning of April 21st was just a big accident. They say their mentally challenged son had accidentally left the dog tied to the bumper of his father's truck, and then he drove off not seeing the animal. After he was dragged for what officials say were several miles, we're told the owner thought he was dead and left him in a ditch to pick up later. When he returned, homeward bound, and police had already arrived and taken the dog to a vet where he was euthanized. Homeward bound wanted criminal abuse charges, but Friday they learned the grand jury didn't see it that way. We were very disappointed. Um, not really 100% surprised. Um, so we were kind of prepared to um, seek other actions. So, and we're going to go forward with that. And we knew we weren't going to get maybe first degree charges, uh, which were felonies, um, but we were hoping for at least second degree. And those with Homeward Bound tell me they are speaking with an attorney. They are speaking with the National Humane Society. They say they may seek further action. In Laurel County, Bill Pendleton, now back to you. The owners of the dog did not want to talk to us on camera today.